So I use my PS4 for everything, from streaming Netflix to waking up my flatmate in the middle of the night. And I also recently fell in love with the AirPods for its convenience and sound quality, and I was wondering if I could pair my AirPods with my PS4. And turns out, yes you can. Hi, I'm Vanzi from Smart Ears Proxy, and you probably know by now that the PS4 doesn't play well with third-party headphones. I mean, it didn't even work with my Sony Bluetooth headphones. And if you're watching this, you probably know that it doesn't work with AirPods either. Well, it turns out there are quite a few hacks to connect your PS4. Also, before we begin, make sure you subscribe to this channel because it really helps us out. With that out of the way, let's begin. To get started with this, you'll need the following items to make this method work. A computer with 3.5mm mic and jack, an aux cable, and AirPods, obviously. So here's how it's going to work. We'll connect the PS4 with the TV, obviously, and then connect your Windows computer with the TV using aux cable, and then figure some settings on Windows to reroute the audio to AirPods over Bluetooth. Let's see how it works. If you haven't done it already, connect the console to your TV using HDMI. Next up, connect the TV and computer using aux cable. Some computers have separate ports for headphone and mic, Newer models implement a hybrid jack which can be used both as a headphone or a mic. The hardware part is now done. Next up, open the control panel on your computer and click on hardware and sound. I'd open a new page in the window where you can add devices, change power options, etc. Click on sound to open the settings. The sound dialog box will show you all the devices connected to the computer, including the mic we just set up. Go to the recording tab and make sure the aux cable is connected to the mic out port on the computer Otherwise, it may not show up on the list. Right click on the internal mic option in the list and click to open the properties window. Click on the listen tab and then check the box against listen to this device. Now your computer would play the sound it picks up on the mic port and plays it back onto your default audio output. Simply connect your AirPods to the computer and start playing the game and your audio will reroute to the AirPods. There is, however, one caveat. You can only use this method if you don't need to use the chat functionality. It just routes the audio from the PS4 to the AirPods. And if you're going to play multiplayer games, then your only option is to buy a PlayStation certified headphones. I had this Bluetooth dongle lying around, which I wanted to try and see if it worked with my PS4. And it does. It costs around $30 on Amazon and works with every device which has a 3.5mm headphone jack. You'll need the following items for this to work. A Bluetooth transmitter with AUX support. A pair of wireless Bluetooth headphones or AirPods. Let's see how it works. So connect your TV and your PS4 with an HDMI cable and connect the dongle to the TV using the 3.5mm AUX cable. Put the dongle in pairing mode by pressing and holding the button on the dongle. Put your headphones in pairing mode by pressing and holding the AirPods. The dongle and the AirPods will automatically connect to each other and you can then start listening to the audio from your PS4 using your AirPods. Overall, this dongle works with any device that's got a headphone jack, but it takes an extra step where you connect to the TV first and then to the PS4. I mean, there are devices and dongles that connect directly to your PS4, but I haven't tested them, but the reviews look amazing on Amazon, so give them a go. So there's two distinctive ways to route your audio from your PS4 to either your Bluetooth headphones or even AirPods. The first one is a little bit of a hack if you're willing to spend some extra bucks, but the second one should work flawlessly. So let's hope Sony would address this issue in the next gen console. Until then, just make do with what you've got. I'm Ramsey, thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. Ciao.